Welcome to Goodwin University's Blackboard Collaborate tutorial. This video guide will show you how to host a Collaborate session in Blackboard, and also how to record and save the Collaborate sessions for future viewing. First, log into Blackboard and enter your specific course. Once in your course, scroll down to Course Tools and click Blackboard Collaborate Ultra. Next, click either of the Create Session buttons. Here, you will see a list of options on the right side of your screen. You will want to type a name for the session. Once you enter a session name, the following box will display. Choose the appropriate guest role. If you are setting up this session, you will then be the moderator. Copy the guest link and anonymous dial in PIN if needed, and email the link to your participants. Select the start date, start time, end date, end time. Use no end open session option or an ongoing open session if you want to continuously use this session. Use the repeat session option for repeating collaborate sessions. Keep the early entry default for 15 minutes. It can be changed if needed. Click on the provide description link for adding a description for your participants. This is however optional. Scroll down to session settings to set up the recording, participant and moderator permissions. As a general rule, you can keep the default options. If you would like to save and download the recording, then put a check in the box. When done, press save to create the session. Now the session is created and you will be brought to the following screen. Your session is listed below. Clicking on the three lines in the top left corner will open another menu box. The menu box displays as follows. If you choose to create a recording of your Collaborate session, then once your session is over, click on Recordings to view it. We will go over the recording process at the end of this video. When it's time for the Collaborate session to begin, click on the title of your session and click Join Session. If you are accessing Blackboard Collaborate for the first time on this computer, you may be prompted with an audio test. So here you can just go through the process and assuming all is working with your microphone, you can click Yes, it's working. Next, it will do a video test. If you're using a video component with your camera, you'll see what your camera sees. And again, assuming all is working, you can click yes, it's working. Next, you'll be brought to a tutorial option. For the purpose of this video, we're gonna click later and skip this option, but you're more than welcome to click start tutorial if you wanna go through the Blackboard Collaborate tutorial that is offered. You will then be brought to a screen that looks like this. This is essentially the dashboard of Collaborate. If you would like to record your session and download it to your computer, you will click on the three lines icon in the top left corner. Click on start recording. Use the same steps to stop recording. It is suggested that you start the recording after your audio and video components are set up. Your screen will populate with options and displays. Click on the icons at the bottom to set up your audio and video settings. The last icon is for participants to raise their hand. Clicking the purple tab in the bottom right corner will open up more session options. The first option is the chat option. You can use this to chat with all of your participants in addition to the audio and video options. The second option is the listing of participants. The third option is to share content. You can share a blank whiteboard, an application, or your entire screen and files. You can also poll your participants. Click on each option to use it. The last option is for additional settings such as speaking volume. When the session is done, you can exit the Collaborate session by clicking the icon in the top left corner. The following menu box will appear. Click on Leave Session at the bottom. You are now at the You Have Left Session screen, and you can close this tab in your browser and go back into Blackboard. You have successfully hosted and or presented a Blackboard Collaborate session now. You can follow these steps to download your recording from Blackboard Collaborate if you chose to record it. Click on the three lines icon on the top left corner of the main screen as shown here. Click on Recordings. Click on the Recordings option icon. It is a tiny circle on the right side with three dots in it. Recordings may take some time to appear after your session, so if it does not appear here, try again every few minutes until it shows up. A menu box will appear with several different options. Click on Download. The standard Windows box will appear. Click on Save File to download the MP4 file to your computer. These options will change depending on your browser and operating system. For example, if you are using Firefox on a Windows PC like in this screenshot here, you will see a Save As message. You can save the Collaborate video to a location of your choice on your computer. This concludes the Blackboard Collaborate tutorial. Thank you.